Hi right, guys, welcome back to another Steam Free to Play walkthrough. Today we have Aurora, A Child's Journey. As always, I'll leave a link to the game in the description if you want to try it for yourself. And if you like the video, please like and subscribe. We'll play through it and then we'll watch the credits. Dun dun dun, look at all that trash, bro. She gonna clean up the neighborhood? Captain Aurora asking permission to sail. E to imagine. Ah, imagination. Oh, a new journey achievement. Nice, it has achievements. Sick. Hey, not that fast. Oh, do I have to, like, find it? Oh, man. I oh, I died! Oh, God. <laughs> this place is dangerous. I fell into the sewage boy. <laughs> Lord almighty. Old big-headed girl just went straight into the sewer water. Uh-oh, what am I doing now? Oh, this is awesome. This is a magical world. All the water's clean. I'm imagining the water's clean. It's not actually clean. There's a problem here. Yeah, I'm just like... I guess this is a story of life is what you make it, I guess. With imagination. Huh. This is awesome. Really beautiful game. Ooh. Back to trash land. So if I fall into the water while it's trash, that's when I die. But, can I push this? Looks like it's pushable. Yeah! This plays pretty nice too. Good graphics, plays nice, really pretty. I think she was having an asthma attack from pushing the box. Well, I mean, her head's like quadruple the size of her body. That's how you know she's a child, because her head's ginormous. This boat is taking me places. Okay, what am I supposed to do here? Push it? No, you talked me into it, I guess. Why? Oh, okay, I got you. Thank you, game. Very nice of you. Who lives in that shack, I wonder? No one? Can I go in there? No, my head's too big. Jesus Christ, dude, her head is like almost the size of the buildings. <laughs> it's actually like a ginormous baby. La 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 la. Clean up the water, Mr. Boat. Please. Okay, we're... Oh, he's going that way. We're going different ways now. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Alright, where are we going before the water runs out on me? Oh! Goodness, I about died again. That would have been tragic. What if you have to restart all the way over when you die? I wonder if there's checkpoints. I wonder if each light is a checkpoint. That'd be nice. We'll never find out, hopefully. Uh oh, I probably wasn't supposed to drop there. Oh, am I doomed? Oh, no, wait. Aha! Cool. There might have been multiple ways to do that path, actually. That was pretty neat. I dig it. Yeah, I'm liking this game a whole heck of a lot. This is really nice. Very aesthetically pleasing. Oh, it's a boat. Oh my god, I'm escaping. I'm escaping my tribe. This is what you guys get for littering. Gotcha! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What's happening? Oh, it's that guy from Fern Gully. Only a monster would do that. We'll make him pay. What's that dude's name from, uh, Burn Gully? I have to get there. I have to stop this boat monster. Oxacoos or whatever. I know he's done by Tim Curry. It's getting dark. I'm glad I brought my flashlight. Yeah. Oh, do I have to flashlight it in the face? Oh, prepare to get... What was that? It's a monster. A spooky... Ah, a monster! Uh-oh. The pollution monster achievement. I can keep it away with my flashlight. Okay, too easy. Oh, so I gotta actually flashlight that sucker. This is scary. Uh-oh. 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 Get back, Satan! <laughs> oh, Lord Almighty. Oh, he's coming again. Ooh, get back. This is scary, bro. We are in a traumatic situation right now. 
Yeah, I guess these are checkpoints, I'm assuming. I'm hoping. Luckily, I don't need to see where I'm going to steer. All my ages of adulting have prepared me for this moment. Uh-oh, he's coming from so- Ooh, he's coming from the front! He almost got me. He thought. You thought, son. You goofed. Uh-oh, there's another one somewhere. No, there's not. I'm good. Oh, he's scary looking, bro. The smoke monster's scary. <laughs> it's traumatic. This poor child. <laughs> I'm just gonna row my boat. Watch some sm so much pollution. I'm sure this has something to do with the smoke monster. Alright, let's kill this bad boy. Oh no, poor little fishies. Mommy always says that we go to heaven. I hope they go there too. Of course, all animals automatically go to heaven. At least in my religion they do. <laughs> my own made up religion. <laughs> Yay, Mr. Boat. Uh oh. I might have took off too late. We did it. What am I supposed to be doing here, actually? Let's go this way. Oh man, we're in a factory. We've this is quite the journey that we're making. Uh oh. Oh, is that thing evil? Is it gonna kill me? I have to jump in it, right? Okay, I can do this. Probably. Oh, I don't know. It's scary. Oh, it kills me. Okay, okay. Just don't touch it. You have to go underneath it, I guess. Is it done? Okay. I win this round. Oh, heck! Oh, well. Give me my light power back. <laughs> Alright, I got you this time. I thought I was supposed to jump it in and get, like, launched over something. That apparently is not what I was doing. Supposed to sneak underneath it. Ooh, baby. Oh, we made it. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Here is my handle. Something, something, snout. Do, 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 do. The terminal achievement. Nice. I think we only have one achievement left to go. Easy achievements too, this is a really nice game. I enjoy it. I think it's gonna be insanely short, but still super dope. Uh oh. Why do the monsters come alive with my imaginations? It's my nightmare imaginations. Don't drop that on me, please. That would be toxic. That would not be okay, actually. Uh oh. Oh gosh, it's a speed run. Okay, I got you. I got you. Too easy. I guess. Oh, wait. Oh, he's still going. We did it. We the best. Okay. We're destroying things. Nice. Good job, us. Our imagination power might be too strong. We're kind of like that fire starter girl. <laughs> they tried to experiment on me, so I burned everything to the ground. Uh-oh. Donkey Kong. Hi, Donkey Kong. Don't worry, I got... Oh, no, I'm not jumping him. I was about to say, I was about to try, but I don't think I have the hops, unfortunately. Don't ever catch me alive. Aha! Aha! No, Mr. Barrel, no! <laughs> we made it. We're the best. Ah, oh, this is where we fire start. This is where we're going to turn everything on fire. We're the best, boys. Uh-oh. I knew it. I knew it. We're pyrokinetic. It's hot here. Here we go. I'm doing it. Look, she's raising her hand. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Am I dead? Oh, no. I'm good. Okay, cool. Yeah, see, I put the fires out. I'm the best, actually. One man's journey, or one little girl's journey, to save Fern Gully. Oh wow, that thing's scary as heck. Is that? <laughs> I was about to say, it's Kingpin. Not Kingpin. Boss fight. Oh no, he killed me. He threw me in the sewer. How could he do such a thing? But why? 
I guess we lost. Well, that sucks. Next time. Uh oh, I'm slowing down. I'm losing traction. Look at all the dead fish. I couldn't save you. I'm sorry. One last hope achievement. Am I going to imagine them back to life? Ah, the credits, so I don't have to look at them. Well, this game was pretty amazing. Thank you to the creators for making it. It was a ton of fun to play through. And thank everybody for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Hopefully me talking incessantly wasn't too annoying over this cinema cinematic masterpiece. It was more like a walking simulator, but it was really nice. I enjoyed it. Aurora's story was inspired by a huge fire that happened in the region of Sao pa I don't know how to pronounce it, Brazil in 2015, caused by the explosion of a fuel pump at a chemical terminal. The fire lasted about nine days and had numerous consequences for the environment and for the communities living close to the place it happened. I made it. During and after the fire, nine tons of fish killed by river contamination were collected. In the addition of to the appearance of various respiratory diseases in local residents, until today, the communities that depended on fishing, such as the village of Aurora, suffer from the lack of fish, the contamination of the river, and the diseases caused by the catastrophe. This was neither the first nor the last time the human action has caused major environmental disasters. We are the only ones capable of re repairing the damage already done, fighting to avoid even more of them, and seeking justice for the people harmed. Ah, it even has like a real life story to it. This was actually awesome. I was thinking Fern Gully, but this was actually based off something real. Sick. And you get 100% of the achievements just by playing through it. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Bye!